New York in zero seconds. And he arrived at Harvard at this time, okay? Find the time it took to get to Harvard in SI unit. Okay, so it looked like that's 8.07, 32, but what the frick is SI unit? This is just too hard. We have our student over here. What's your name? My name is Abona Isaac Bach. What is the SI unit for time? I know what time is, but I don't... Uh, what is the SI unit? Here is a clock, right? Clock has how many hands? Well, three, the minute, the second, the hour. Can you show me the hour hand? Uh, the hour hand would be the shortest, so maybe the black one? Yes. And can you show me the minute hand? Hmm. Uh, red. No, red hand is not minute hand. Try again. Maybe red is second and brown is minute. Brown one is the minute hand. Now, can you show me the second hand? The second hand is probably red because that's the only other choice, the only other option. That's right. So now, which way the clock ticks? Can you show me? Now, the clock ticks clockwise. <laughs> Funny. Uh, no, try true. again. Try again. The clock ticks clockwise this way. The clock doesn't tickle that way. Doesn't it, it tick this From way? here, it ticks this way. Oh, it ticks like this. Good, very good. So, right, so, so the hour moves. This way, the minute hand moves this the way, same way, and the They're second all, hand. All move the same way. Same. Tell me what time it is. Okay. So the black is hour. So I'd say eight, maybe. And then it looks that it's in the middle of one and two. So I'd say oh seven. And then it looks as if. Hmm, I would say 30, 32 seconds. Oh. Good try. Oh. But that's not a correct answer. Oh, God. Uh, so, you know, the problem is, second. I left home zero second. Can you show me? So, that would technically be 12. No, can you draw it? So, uh, on the clock, that would look like this. So, if you put 12 here, 3 here, 6, 9, I believe it would look like this. So the hour hand has to point here. The minute hand would also point at 12. So all of them Very good. are pointing at the same time. Alright, okay. So I left I left New York at 0 second. And I arrived Harvard at this time. At that time. 8, 0, 7, and 30. Okay? Well, it would take you a bit to get out there. Alright, so can you tell me how long it took for me to uh, get to Harvard in SI unit? Um, what is SI unit? SI unit for time is second. Oh, I guess so. Okay. So, 8 hours, 7 minutes, 30 seconds. I said 32. It's 30, 32. 32. Oh, yeah, 32. Wow. That's kind of precise. 60 minutes an hour means every minute is 60. 60 times 60 is 3,600. 3,600 times 8. So 36 times 8 is going to be, I'm going to do a very quick calculation. So, and then 8 times uh, 3 is going to be 24. And then. All right, yeah, it took me 29,252 seconds to get to the Harvard. Congratulations. Now, can you tell me what is the SI unit for time? But the SI unit for time is obviously going to be seconds. All right. Okay, so uh, that's it. The student had no understanding of SI unit of time before. Uh, and it's confusing because some students think the hour is the SI unit, or minute is the SI unit, or even the year is the SI unit. But uh, Millennia? Uh, so finally, the student hopefully understood uh, the SI unit for uh, for the time, and that is second. Thank you, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.